Hey everyone, so in this video I want to talk about the difference in padding density and thickness. So I have three different pads here. This one is going to be just a, um, a 3 8 6 pound. Very squishy, very common. This is what goes in most homes. Next will be an 8 pound and this is going to be 7 16 So this is 7 16 8 pound with no moisture barrier and this is what I would recommend go in most homes it's a very good pad very durable long lasting next is going to be half inch eight pound pad with the moisture barrier and this one if it was seven sixteenths if it was like this with the moisture barrier that's what I would recommend but in my opinion this is a little too thick half inch is a little too much and I'll explain what kind of carpet goes on each of these. So here you have pretty th dense carpet. So this one would be good on everything, but I would probably stick with the 7 16 on this one, or even the half inch is fine. It can go on this, but if you really want your carpet to last, I would go with the 8 pound, not a 6 pound. For thinner carpets like this, like a loop pile or a pattern where it really has a low pile, I would always go with a 3 8 and try to go with an 8 pound. But you can also go with a 7 16 8 pound. You would not want to go with a half, a half inch. That would be a bad installation and this would cause wrinkles in the future. So I would go with a 3 8 definitely, 3 8 8 inch pad. So that's kind of the difference in carpet padding density and thickness. Again, my favorite, I would go with a 7 16 8 inch pad. I wouldn't really worry about the moisture barrier too much, but I would go with this. That would be my choice. So hopefully that helps somebody out. Thanks for watching.